I guess we start playing now, because... I don't know, what else am I supposed to do? Let me just fix the camera, alright. Reverie! Well, how it's not even at the top of the list. That's funny. So, first of all, I'm gonna do a little practice run, because... Because why not, you know? It's also, like, sort of unreasonably cold for this time. Like, it's not on a, on a level of cold that it annoys me. But usually at this time, it's... It's not this cold. So my finger might go down to sub-zero temperature, and that's not something I can, you know, have right now. Because I'm playing GD. So this part kind of sucks. Because of the last wave, but generally it's not too bad. Like from zero, for some reason, I have I do not have the ability to do that consistently. So... Well, this part's... okay. Unless if I, like, get a lag spike, uh, the sport's free. And now this part. The transition sucks, but, uh, the part itself is weird. So th these first few clicks are kind of random. The rest is normal. Except for the spider. The spider kind of sucks, but nothing else. This, this part also kind of bugs out sometimes. It's pretty much RNG. And that, this click is pretty dumb, but other than that, it's pretty good. The UFO used to mess me up a lot, but I've, I've gotten a good click pattern for it. Oh my god, I can only imagine the bitrate we're gonna have with these. <laughs> There's, there are just too many colors on the screen at once. This part is weird. That UFO used to be impossible, but I've gotten used to it. Now it's mainly about the wave. The wave is the part that gets me here. Come on, why do I keep dying there? How, how am I managing to click early? Yeah, this wave. Infamous for being dumb, you just have to do a bl almost blind click there, then do this, and then the ship part is pretty easy, but for some reason I struggle with it. Like, that's just too difficult for my brain to comprehend or something, like, doing this is hard. Hi, Gizbro. Alright, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. We're gonna play from zero anyway, because I already did all the practice I needed. And also, if you guys want a hand cam, I mean, I can offer that. You can see how I click. It's kind of weird. I got this thing going on where I, for some reason, grip the mouse with my thumb. But I don't use the rest of my fingers, I just touch it with my thumb and I don't know. I mean, this level in general is crisp, so you shouldn't be surprised, I mean. Unless you're in 144p, this level will always be crisp. Crispy. Crispier than pork belly. Bro, Kana, can you like stop lagging? Alright, we're getting to sub zero temperatures, guys. Let's go. I'm starting to feel my hand less. Crispy Concords. If I get past 40... Oh my fu- Why do I die so stupidly, dude? Like, I just do some of the most confusing deaths to ever exist. But what, what I was saying is, if I get it past 45, the bit rule will go down. Like, meow. You know? Because of the colors. The sheer amount of colors on screen will screw with my bit rate. So be prepared for that, I guess. I'm not being an idiot anymore. All right. Don't 
die stupidly. I died- I died at the same place I died last time! Or no, wait, I died at the spider last time, alright. <laughs> I died at 61, great. But good progress, I guess. I passed the 45 wave first attempt, what? How? Impossible. The cloud is so big? The cloud. Damn, the cloud really be messing with your connection, isn't it? Just so y'all know, I have my thumb on my spacebar right now. That's what I used to spam at the spammy ports. Some people might agree, some might not, but that's just how I do it. And I'm pretty sure Technical did it like that too, I'm not sure. Really? Really? You died at the first wave? The wave? Great! Okay, don't be an idiot, please. That pad has to be one of the most useless things ever. Like, I don't ever use it. Also getting far, what? No way. Such a god-awful death. You're getting flooded, oh my god. How hot? How high in the air are you that a cloud is coming down? <laughs> Dude is literally in the misty mountains. Really? <laughs> Time to watch you 144B. What's going on there? Like over here there's just a bunch of wind and there's no sunlight because a lot of clouds. But that's about it. Like there's literally nothing else going on. It's unusually cold for you know for it to be early September, but Okay. You just never know. Some of the paths in this level are just very useless, if you ask me. If you don't want, I can show you what my hand's doing right now when I play this part. Alright, let's go. Hand can- but where do I place it though, so that you can- can- you can see it. Wait, you got the fucking damn it. I have a Rubik's cube right here. I use this to, like, position my phone, because this is the optimal setup for my phone to play- be placed in. Well, wait. Eh? Nah? Or yes. I don't know. Is this a makeshift tripod I just have? Uh, okay, I think this will work. But it's like, I'm on the verge of falling down. Oh, I can make it lay it down. Oh, I laid it down. Let's see, let's go. Alright, let's just, um... Alright, there we go. You guys can see my hand now. Uh. <laughs> Alright, give me a second, guys. Cameras suck ass to control. Alright, I think this will work. Alright, you guys just can't see my spacebar, that's it. So yeah, there's your 0.1 CPS meter. I missed the orb, let's go. Okay, great, lag spike. Love how I get... I get lag spikes that just throw you off. They don't even kill me most of the time. They just throw me off so much that I cannot fix myself in time. Like, I don't know. They're just troll lag spikes. Yeah, amazing. Uh, I, I, how do I manage to click so much? I, for some reason, my the hand falls asleep and I just click and don't let go. Like, that's just... Yeah, great. Whatever. I guess my nerf control is good, but it breaks randomly. Ah, amazing. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, good to boob. Oh, great. <laughs> I, I didn't understand what you meant for a second, but now I got it. Yeah. Like how am I clicking? I don't know when I started clicking like this. I usually play on my up arrow, so... 
I just chose whatever was more viable for me right now. I all right. I don't even get nervous there anymore. That's good. So I just don't get nervous until I pass the wave. That's good because I can actually focus. I shouldn't be getting nervous in the first place, but I don't know. I have no control over it. Rain begun. Oh my god. I don't know if that's a good or bad thing, to be honest. Here, over here is a good thing because it's hot most of the time. But then the aftermath is a problem because when it does rain here, uh, we usually have a few houses that get flooded. It's like California, but less severe in every way. But it's also just much smaller in terms of size, so it has a bigger effect, even though it has less of an effect, if you understand what I mean. Like, I don't know if I got my thoughts across correctly, but if you if you know, you know, you know. <laughs> if you know, you know, you know. Especially in the summer. In the winter, it's kind of the opposite, because it doesn't snow here, usually. It only starts to snow in, like, early March or something, and I don't know why. So, unless if it's winter, rain is pretty nice here. And the winter is always just wet. Everywhere. And the funny thing is, after it rains, then the then the like, coldness comes, so... It just f makes icicles and stuff, but no snow. One time, it, uh, let's tell a story time. I was down in the yard, right, uh, with my dog, just playing with him, you know usual doggy activities and uh, I will go and look at the sink and I see that like a portion of it's just pouring out uh, off the side and I see that the pipe bursted because of this coldness and before that happened I checked the faucet and there was no water coming out it was frozen solid so I didn't know what to do about it I told my parents and they were I don't know if they plan to do anything about it like I can I really couldn't tell you but Two hours go by, and the bursted pipe magically stops, like it's no longer spitting water. And the reason for that was that it froze, apparently. The water within the pipe froze, the water that got outside also froze, and it froze in such a matter that it created like a, uh, an ice platform, where, right where the pipe was spilling from. So we just got a little ice rink in my yard. Of course it melted eventually, uh, but it was pretty funny. And I used to like mm, throw hammers and stuff at it, try to crack the ice, it was pretty fun. My dog also liked it because he could like slip around and he had fun in the slippery uh, thing. But yeah, that's how my pipe burst. And then after that happened, uh, we called the repairman, he put a pl plastic uh, pipe lid over the actual pipe, so now it just doesn't spill anymore. I mean, it was about time we replaced that faucet because it was getting rusty as hell. It was old, like I think it's 92 years old now. I'm not even joking. So, yeah, that's the story of how my faucet burst and made an ice rink in my yard. Remember going outside and I was just bewildered by the amount of ice on the ground there were like chunks of ice icicles it was unique to say the least and for me that temperature where the water like freezes like that, that isn't even cold so i that's why i got confused i don't feel that temperature as cold necessarily a rate of cold where i get annoyed i should say and i don't know why i'm not even thinking when i'm speaking right now I'm just mumbling a bunch of nonsense. It does show how much this level can ruin your fluency in English. Now I'm back to normal because I'm not even focusing anymore. But yeah, you should really practice multitasking while also speaking. Another thing is that I just over salivate a lot, so it ruins my uh, ability to speak. But I'm excited for this year's winter. The climate has been changing in a way where it's been getting colder. Like, the snow has been coming in earlier than usual. Also, I'm gonna f sh 
fix the webcam now because I want you all to focus on my face. Really should have some water on me, but we'll let's see how long I can go without it. Oh my god, Flamenico original, oh my god! I'm not even streaming early, though, that's the thing, like... I should be having a few viewers at least, how good Sharky's part looks. I don't remember the names of the creators of the individual parts, so... I don't know which one Sharky is. I guess we'll get to her eventually. Unless you were talking about Sparky. Because that doesn't say Sharky, it says Sparky at the trash gameplay part. So does it say like... Uh, peroxide or something? Because that's what I always read there. I don't know. Oh, it's, it does say Sharky. Why did I always think it was Sparky? I'm blind. Dude, I'm blind. Now that I think about it, yeah, it is Sharky. Why would it be Sparky? <laughs> yeah, it does say it. Yeah. I'm dumb, dude. Then again, why would it be Sparky? Is it like GDS bot Sparky that's making this part? Guess the level easy mode and just shows a random singular pixel that you're supposed to guess off of on a random level that nobody has ever seen before. Yeah, easy difficulty. Never understood how to change Sparky game mode, like, difficulties. But then again, easy difficulty is like the same as medium, so... Like, it, it's genuinely difficult to guess, for me at least. I don't know about y'all, but for me, not easy. My best streak is four. Literally, it's just four. I didn't spam fast enough. I should really put my index finger on my space, but when I do that, yeah. That's probably a better plan. Oh, I totally thought I was gonna die there. Yeah. I totally thought I was gonna die there. Imagine if your laptop actually handled the limo at like 120 FPS. Because at this point, I wouldn't even be surprised. You see what... You did see what not being in full screen did. You could change your FPS dramatically. Better yet, you should play Jesse Pinkman. Yeah, that's a good level. Or Walter White, or literally any of them, because then you would surpass Holy and tell him that every single level he's ever beaten is easy. Troll. Just to get back at him, just complete a top 50 demon. Why am, why am I dying there now? First three times I got there, I never died there, now I am. Yeah, great. Of course, I got a lag spike. I got a, I got got a lag spike! spike! When I'm in my house, I can actually yell. Hmm. Gives me an idea. But I don't want to yell. I don't know, I'm just not made... I'm just not built for yelling. Welcome, Sergi. Thanks for the luck. Should really be saying Baja Amigos de Shunai. Lucky Golden Walnut. My back started itching when I got there. Great. Because, like, that spam is free if you actually spam. Which I failed to do for some reason. So I do have time to say it. Most effective at spam parts, <laughs> yeah. Future Funk 2. N wait, not Duelo Maestro, but here. It's, yeah, it's just everywhere. It's everywhere. I'm sick and tired of Future Funk 2, to be honest. Like, I don't even wanna play it, because I've already, like, drained it out of, drained it completely. Like, I have only 2% left to do, and I've had all my fun with it. I don't really see a reason to finish it, but I guess I will eventually. I just don't know when. Only goes here. I doubted the transition, come on. That's such a shitty part to do to, like... Whatever. Whoa, wait. Did I just get 69? I think I got 69, lol. But, yeah, funny number, yeah! Funny number! 
Yeah, buddy! Let's go. I have Yabare strength now. Shit. <laughs> yeah, Bajalo does work. We should combine the two. Like, Yabare powers and also Bajalo Nikozi powers. Sergi just loves spamming random emojis. I, it's, it's hilarious. He just finds the random poop emoji and starts spamming it randomly. Skibbity toilet, yeah. I never understood Skibbity toilet. It's about like cameras and toilets fighting each other or something. Like Sky Game told me about that, but I have no idea on, ex on exactly what it is. Shit. My finger's cold. Hmm. Yeah. If you don't have like 67 mods on, why should anyone care, you know? Like a normal showcase isn't enough nowadays. You need clicks, RTX, no LDM, LDM, like yeah. You need to have like six segmented runs of each part being a slightly different for people to be satisfied with showcases nowadays. Like, <laughs> one of the showcases will be with LDM, the other one will be without LDM. One of them will be RTX. But then you combine the two, which makes like nine possibilities or whatever it is. Like, you just have a ton of things to do. And you also have to do with with trending levels, because YouTube's so funny that if you post something about a level that is at least one year... Ooh, what am I fucking saying? What am I supposed to say? Anyway. Esari, Reverie. What I was gonna say is... Uh, I forgot. So yeah, doesn't, doesn't matter anymore. Yeah, what I was gonna say is, if you wanna get like views on a showcase level, if this show, if whatever you are showcasing is like one year old or more, you're gonna have a bad time, because nobody's gonna care by that point. Unless if it's very important in the GD community like limo. Like if I did a limo showcase with full detail, which would lack a ton, but if I still did it, I would probably get 1,000 views minimum, but I wouldn't be able to pull that stuff in three years. It's all about relevancy nowadays, like they always need new and new and new. God, I sound like a grandpa talking about this. And back in my day, there were no things such as YouTube shorts and everything was 67 minutes long. And then you guys just show like TV shows on your TV. TV shows on YouTube, stuff like that. I don't think Sergi knows what the word criticize means. I knew I would die there at least once. Yeah, that, that makes total sense. I am not mad about that. That makes perfect sense. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense, yeah. Next time I won't die there because it's actually not that hard. I was just, you know, adjusting. Where I will die the most is 82. It's a miracle I got past that like second attempt too. Like I, it's just, it's pretty cool. I used to be not consistent at that UFO, like at all. But now I'm getting used to, used to it. It's an insane demon, but like if you ask the, me or Flame or anyone else, they would tell you that it's much harder than Cataclysm, at least in my opinion, like, it's, it, in gameplay wise, it's still pretty hard, mostly because of its length, and also, uh, it's just hard. I didn't say Bajal Lingozi, Bajal Lingozi. I'm so, I'm so stupid, I forgot to say it, no. That's just what I get for not saying Bajra Lundigozi. In a little tribute video made for Team Fortress 2 and one of the actors, I accidentally spelled rest in peace as in P-I-E-C-E. -E, not peace as in P-A-P-E-A-C-E. -E. Specifically when I made a tribute video, I had to like screw up my spelling. Amazing. That's why I, I unlisted the video, because it was just too embarrassing for me to put it up again. I unlisted it once, then I republished it, and then I re-unlisted it, because it's just too stupid of a spelling mistake to for me to let it go public. People who got it through the notification will still receive and see it, but most people won't. Unless if I give the link. 
Speaking of which, uh, rest in peace with me. GD is the only thing that can really screw with my fluency in English. My brain goes super ultra goblin mode when I play GD for some reason. And I'm just not able to formulate the simplest of sentences consistently. And also I just develop a lisp when I play GD for some reason. Like I know how to say the letter C. Like S, you know? But sometimes I just go th I don't know why. My tongue is too big for my mouth physically. My god, let me go see. I don't like mashing this much, that's why I don't do it, I just don't like to. Lag spike! Great! <laughs> Great! Amazing! Just forgot to click. I got a lag spike and then I st it just screws me up. Why do I get these random lag spikes? Should I be in a pesta when I beat this? That's the question. I don't know. Nick XD, Cherry Team. Did it actually get proven that it was hacking? Yes. You like, with 100% proof? Yes. I know whatever he did was fake. Like, it's obvious, but did it actually get proven? What am I doing? Click! What am I doing, dude? Why did, why did I hold and then let go too early? My finger just became lazy. I'm actually so dumb, dude. Because I passed all the bullshit in that part and then I died there of all places. I don't think I've died there once. Like, I think that's the first time I've ever died there. Including practice, by the way. I thought my uh, my hand and knuckle would have gone cracked, but it didn't. So it caught me off guard. It feels like it should, but it's it just isn't. Sick video, got it though. More like Michigan's last video saying stop in Georgian. I don't even think Dezon noticed that. And he's like obsessed with Michigan. Michigan, I should say, not Michigan. So. By the way, rest in peace, Michigan. Then we went through a lot of people who died this stream. Rick May, Michigan. Who, what else? When are we gonna talk about Juice World? <laughs> I want to bring out lobster! Now that I itch my left eye, it just burns. That's great. Michigan. I remember finding out that he died, and I remember distinctly that I messaged Dezon about that, and I said that he probably died of coronavirus. I remember that exactly, that I thought that was the reason. And of course, we don't know why that happened, like why he died, but still. That was just my assumption, because I was like 11 or something back then. That, that was the only thing I knew. Coronavirus. I didn't develop mentally until late 2022. Or, 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 Please! I hate when I die at spam parts because I'm spamming and it's not doing anything. Twinkle, 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 <sighs> twinkle, 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 twinkle. No! Twinkle, 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 twinkle. Once from 45, I kept died there when I was like beginning to <laughs> play level. Twinkle, now I died there give me again. Twinkles, twinkles, Why twinkles, does it twinkles. hold so much? Why is it such a small micro click? I have nothing to talk about anymore. Oh, an asshole suit. The guy eventually went broke in a competition where he, in a cooking competition, and he had to wear his quote-unquote. Carrot pepper pants. 
He has elephant asshole suits and carrot pepper pants. He also got a plane tailored in which the seats were tailored in elephant asshole. And a card that was tailored in Siberian Husky Piss, if I remember correctly. Yeah, he, he was a meth cook. Judging by what he made and bought, he might as well have been me a meth cook. It was Walter all along. I'm gonna bring Miles Morales from the Spider-Verse movies and make him play this. Why, dude? Why? Why is this computer betraying me this much? SHUT UP! I farted! I am so happy. At least I got past it. Jesus Christ. No, I'm happy now. See ya. That's it. I'm happy now. My mood has been completely revived because I got past the dumbass parts. Alright, we just gotta do the ending then, that's it. Hmm, you know what? Let me just find a good key. See? 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 See this? Oh no, no! Oh no! Yummy! Slowly. Oh my god! Stop! Yes! Thank you! Thank you! This is actually real! It's real! It is real! It is real! Oh my god! The Ocular Miracle Trilogy completed. This is real. More attempts than faith. Y'all would not believe how long I've been doing this for. I think it's been six months. Yeah, I began in like early August. <laughs> I began in like early August. 
Now it's December 31st, right before New Year's. I did it. I did it. Okay, let's count. So, this is 94 plus reveries. Not there. 94. So, 55. 5550. Oh, exactly. That's beautiful. I kind of want to add it up now. Alright. Ocular. So, it's. 5550s plus, I mean, let's just do it manually, I guess. I think it was this plus 94, then plus. How much did it take me for me to beat Faith? 5212, it's it's a bit off, but whatever. 5212, <laughs> I mean, 5121, one, wait, what? Since when? That's 5, right, that's 5212, yeah. Plus diligence. <coughs> Seven two one two. That's beautiful. Seven two one two, which equals. Uh, let's get a calculator up for this one. Not ocular. <laughs> Hilarious. Mm hmm. Okay. So, put this here. Five four six six plus ninety four plus five two one two plus seven two one two. All right, which is seventeen nine eight four. Okay, <laughs> seventeen k attempts to beat this trilogy. Seven nine eight four attempts. Ocular trilogy completed. Reverie. Faith. Diligence. Man. All right. Well, thanks for uh, watching. And uh, yeah. See y'all. Nice.